11 years now, um, I've been able to proudly wear this shirt that says, Shed the Heavens. Have a good look at it and look at the word shed. And as I said to Kathleen before, Kathleen before, what does shed really mean? Do you see a place? Do you see a place? Do you see the old shed out the back? Or do you see something that sheds, sheds from here? And I can tell you, there's no confliction between the shed that happens with the hands-on thing, none whatsoever, but the shed we do is the part that goes from man's heart, spirit, soul, and spine and core of who we are. Now, we do not have, um, we're uh, you know, incorporated, not-for-profit and all that stuff, but we don't want the bureaucrats to get near us. We have the minimum amount of meetings we have. This is not a hands-on tradey thing. This is for all. Peter Dutton here, Minister for Health, he sat up the front of our shed. He spilled his guts. Shed means spill your guts. Get rid of the crap so you can become the real deal who you are. Men are okay. It's under the radar. It's going through the country. I'm here with a positive message. I go on ABC with Bill Smith now. You'll probably hear our little Shed Happens show. Innocently, now going all over Australia and Asia Pacific because people want to hear reality. The hardest thing for us men now is to go the journey from our head to our heart. My book I wrote in November. If you want a copy of it and you can't afford to pay for it, I'll give you one. Just tell me your name and address and I'll post it to you. Because it's a journey of heart. I can tell you, men of Australia are spiritual men. We are one-on-one -on -one and we are very shy. Normally we are shy, but in spiritual we are very, very, very shy. I know what I'm talking about. I've sat in my business in a truck beside men for 16 years. I know the heart of an Australian men. We've been living in our heads for too long. The journey is on, the journey is now. It's going whether you want to get aboard or not. We are doing it. I go all over Australia now encouraging men and starting shed nights. Pretty well everywhere I go there's a hundred men that want to get up and go. And when a man gets to be able to openly go trust him at shed where he can be interviewed and get rid of the good or the bad or the happy or the sad, he can go deeper than a woman and he can get it out there and then we learn from each other. And then once our we go the, into the hearts, we courageously then go on to another man. And then we don't need any waving of flags. We don't need any uh, publicity. We just go on. Go ahead, fellas. Welcome. And this is the journey that our country's on. And nothing will change. The programs are all good. We have 150 men at our shed night every month. And we get 20 odd come from Munia, the Drug and Rehabilitation Centre in Brisbane. Those men do 43 week programs and they get about an 85% and they can't get the rest because they, we haven't got the guts and know-how to approach the spiritual part of who we are. Because as soon as you say spiritual people go, what happened when I was little, did the priest or did this? They put a, they put a blank up on a denominational thing and a tag that's got nothing to do with the spiritual part of who we are. When a man can be safe to let go with him, inside him, he'll get rid of it as quick as he can and he'll say, how do I get on with it and sort it out? And then when a man's got his heart, a woman's got his heart and kids have got his heart, the whole nation changes. And believe you me, if you, if you have no hope in this country for men, come with me wherever you like. Tonight I go to the Springwood, to the Sunnybank RSL to speak to men to encourage men there. Next Saturday morning I'll be in Melbourne and there'll be 150 men there and they all want the heart message. So the message is this, it's 18 inches or 40 centimetres from the head that we were all told that this is how men have to solve problems, uh, work out women's issues and all that. But men now are now okay, we know who we are and I welcome any of you blokes to come on the heart journey for me and men and uh, let's have a good day.